let's see this function is functionally complete or not f of a comma b equal to a prime plus b right so it is also nothing but a implies b so later we shall see in uh, discrete mathematics i'll show you that it is equal to a, you know a implies b we shall see it later in proportional calculus for now just see this i want to prove that it is functionally complete so first thing is you have to get the complement right so i told you that if you have to get the complement maybe you have to try with this a comma a and then b comma b so that you will get rid of completely one variable and the remaining will be only single variable and if it is actually complement then only that is the only way you could get the complement otherwise there is no other way right so let's see this you have to get rid of completely either a or either b if you have to get rid of them first then only one variable will remain and in case if you are lucky that will be complement then you got the complement otherwise there is no other way now see this a comma a if i substitute in place of a and a, a comma a then what do i get here it is fine a complement and in place of b also we have to write a then what is this one and if you do this b comma b in place of a you are going to write b therefore b complement plus in case of b you are going to write b which is nothing but one so you failed there is no way you are getting rid of one of the variables and getting the complement of the other there is no way you are getting getting that right but then if you observe it if you have to kill b if you could kill b somehow then you could get a complement then what is the other way of killing b maybe in place of b if i put zero which means in place of a comma zero if i put b in place of b zero then what do i get a complement or zero which is nothing but a complement yes i got the complementation so this is what uh, from this you could understand that one thing you can directly uh, you cannot uh, directly get complementation so what did you do is you got the complementation indirectly how by killing this right so now we have taken the support of zero already f is there f is not just enough to get the complement so what i did is i have taken the support from zero therefore f comma zero is required in order to get the complementation now let's see using f comma zero only using along with the support from zero let's see whether you could go, get a or or and so if i have to get this or then what is it you complement this if you can simply complement this you are going to get the or if i have to complement this which means if i have to get a here then this one has to be complemented which means here i want a complement what what is a complement f of a comma 0 so if i write like this f of f of a comma 0 what is it it is representing a complement comma b then what happens it is a complement whole complement why in place of a now i am writing a complement plus b it is nothing but a plus b s yes, we are able to get or get and we are able to get negation we are able to get complementation and or so or as well as complementation therefore it is functionally complete but the problem is it is not functionally complete without taking the support from zero we are able to, we should take the support from zero that is the problem so what could you say now directly it is not possible but using the support from zero it is possible so you could conclude that it is not functionally complete directly it is partially functionally complete so whenever any function is taking a support from 1 or 0 then it is called partially partially functionally complete which means for this to be functionally complete you should always take support from 0 otherwise it is not possible got it so that is how we could prove, prove some of the questions so a function can be one is functionally complete or partially functionally complete or not functionally complete at all these three could happen given any function either it could be functionally complete or partial or not right and for this question it is partially functionally complete now even if the support of zeros and ones if it is not able to derive it is if it is not able to be functionally complete then we can declare that it is not functional complete at all right